Good afternoon. Uh, my name is Cesar Borger and I'm an analyst at uh, uh, StocksOnVideo.com and I'm Portuguese so you're going to have to excuse my poor English. And I'm here to make a very brief um, analysis on Triotech, tri tri ticker symbol is TRT and this is the chart since the IPO. You can see the stock didn't do much uh, here until late 2006 and now it is in a a very nice bull run. Look here at the medium term chart. Uh, steadily going up, well, with some swings, of course, but uh, here respecting the 50 days moving average and the stock touched, almost touched the 50 days here in the beginning of July and today it is breaking out to a new all time high. Uh, actually, I made this analysis earlier, but uh, I had some sound problems and uh, problems with the server at stocksonvideo.com so I have to do this very quickly now and uh, you can see the the stock caps up ev every time it uh, reports earnings because they've been uh, very very good and uh, moving on to my valuation model uh, sorry this is the sh short term chart still you can see this breakout with volume above average the stock is up 12% today but uh, I'm gonna buy it anyway and uh, Moving on to the fundamentals and my valuation model. This is a three years model. We have the initial share price, which is the current price at $22.9. Uh, share count, 3.23 million shares. So this is roughly a, a six, uh, 70 million market cap now. And the uh, dilution factor, just 3%. That has been the, well, we don't have time to see that now, but and uh, f which gives me a final share count of three and a half million shares for late 2009 and uh, the revenue over the past four quarters w was uh, 47 million dollars so this is a semiconductor company and 70 million dollars in market cap for 47 million in revenues this doesn't mean a very high um, price to sales ratio it is actually quite low in my view and uh, I expect revenues to grow 40% a year going forward but uh, they grew 100% from 2006 levels uh, this latest quarter which gives me final revenue of 129 million dollars uh, initial net profit margin this is the net profit margin the company had over the past four quarters it was 7.12 percent but uh, and I expect this, this to remain more or less the same here at 8% because the uh, gross margin is just 24% so it can't expand a lot more than this even with revenues growing but uh, maybe 10% is, is quite achievable too and uh, this gives me a final net income of 10.3 million dollars which means earnings per share of two dollars and ninety three cents if we apply to the this stock the industry average valuation of 24 times earnings we get to a final estimated share price of $71.40 or a share price CAGR of 46.1 percent which I find very very attractive and um, an optimal selling price of $45.74 about uh, roughly 100 percent above what is now what it is now uh, so on a 1 to 10 scale I give this a 9 because it is such a small semiconductor company and uh, fundamentals improved quite dramatically here uh, be, since the company moved from Dublin in Ireland to I don't know if it was Dublin sorry but uh, from Ireland to China and uh, it, it revenues increased a lot since the company made that move and uh, net profit margin also expanded uh, so if fundamentals keep improving this way this can be even much better than what I have here it is actually a micro cap semiconductor company uh, very, very profitable and very attractive in my view I'm gonna buy it today for the video portfolio so thank you bye